what's good everyone welcome back to another vlog like and subscribe to the channel you know it and as you can see I got some fresh packages and I don't want to spend too much time on wrapping them I know what it is in here are my skis and um, I only have one ski left so yeah I really need new ones and um, Falkel sent me some and um, let's quickly unwrap them and after we mount them wax them and everything I do to make them ready for snow. So uh, let's go. Alright, we unboxed everything. Here are four skis. That's the Revolt 87 from Falkel. And um, that should be enough for the whole season. And um, four pairs and I still have one pair. So yeah, that should be enough. Two poles, some ski stoppers. And here two helmets from Marker. Ski goggle also from Marker. And over here I have the new bindings from Marker. Some more goggles, some lenses, some stickers. Yeah, thank you so much Falkel. And now I would say let's mount this brand new ski. I'm right now almost finish mounting my first ski. I put the binding in the center always and the din I usually have it on 120 I need to change that on 120 because you don't want that the din is too hard because then when you crash the binding is not gonna open and then it, it could get even worse but um, too light is also not good because then you lose your ski on the takeoff so 120 is enough for me yeah I also need to wax them but yeah, now I think they're almost ready for skiing this week. Perfect, let's go skiing. In flames, in my hometown, we got like a half a meter of fresh snow. But the ski resort locks and um, stays closed because of avalanche risk. Which makes sense, but I heard a friend of mine told me that in Engadin the ski resorts will open and in Engadin it's more in the south they got like a meter of fresh snow. So I was like I have to drive to Gorvac. I had to leave like at 6 o'clock in the morning pretty early because the pass is closed because there's too much snow so I have to drive all the way around and now I'm here in the car train and yeah uh, it takes me an hour more to go this route but I just don't want to miss it because I think there's so much fresh powder and it will be amazing so yeah I'm now on the way and I should be there in an hour at 8.30 ready for the first gondola and ski some epic powder so let's go can't wait <laughs> always think of you when spring comes like it's something in the air at that time don't know why always dream of you when spring comes it's like the heat on my skin takes me by to the time met you on a issues because when I was on the way to Corvac I got the message uh, that Corvac is closed because of avalanche risk and then I was like damn it now I woke up uh, before six o'clock and drove to Corvac for nothing but good thing the other side of the mountain is open and I did now a few laps and there's a lot of snow and it's so much fun but the thing is, this side is a little bit too flat because there's too much snow, so you don't have enough speed. 
um, but it's still a lot of fun and I hope for tomorrow that the other side will open Gorvac because it's steeper and then we will have an epic powder day and by the way I'm in, in here in the chairlift and I'm locked I can't get this thing up bro let me out That was deep. Yeah, she's beautiful. Never saw you be here with me. Ah. I'm surprised when I met you in the doorway. I had a friend, a friend. Never thought I would see you this soon. But hope she really loves you. Cause I swear you deserve everything. Wish that I was. <laughs> It's the next day, I'm here with my brother John and today the other side is open, Corvac and here it's a little bit steeper and I think it has even a bit more snow and we did a few laps, it's a lot of fun as you can see I just crashed and maybe in the afternoon the weather gets a little bit better and it maybe clears up so we can go higher up but yeah for now let's ski down here it's it's fun. <laughs> Didn't care for one another, you and I, you and I <laughs> Thought I was okay, till something in me changed, don't know why Yes, that's don't know why. You got me high, I'm sober You make me lonely when I'm by myself <laughs> that we could be something in the end Something more than friends <laughs> My homie Nikki, um, he showed me a cliff and it's about 10 meters high and we checked it out. There's like one meter or even more of fresh snow in the landing, so should be all safe. And um, he's with the snowboard, he's gonna go first because he knows the cliff and then I'm gonna follow after. I don't know, I think I've never hit such a big cliff. I'm a little bit nervous, but uh, I got this. I just need to warm up before I jump. And either way, if I land, it's gonna be cool. And if, I, if I'm gonna do a tomahawk, it's also gonna be funny and cool. So let's hit it. Moly, Nikki just did a line and he took off from a cliff. It's another one, and then he landed straight on a rock. And then he he was stuck in a hole with his head first, but it's but it's all good. Like he made it out, but was just a little bit uh, scary. I think he's all good. Uh, let's check down there. <laughs> Bro, Nikki just sent the cliff and he hit the fucking rock. Look his board. Look at this, guys. 
lesson out of this day, <laughs> lesson of this vlog. Don't send over stuff or jump off cliffs. You don't know what's behind. Because I thought I could see the landing, I didn't. I hit the rock, here's the little uh, scratch. Fuck. But you know what? Funky snowboard saved <laughs> my life. Thank bro, you. bro, bro, sketchy. So sketchy as fuck. Super lines. I had an amazing week here in Corvac. Um, in the morning I focused on my jumps, did park in the morning. Then when the shadow arrived I went into the powder with my brother and some friends and I really enjoy doing backcountry skiing because most of the time I'm traveling uh, all over the world doing competitions and I don't have time for that. So always enjoy it every year and I hope you enjoyed it as well watching this vlog. Make sure to keep watching, views are high so thank you so much for that. And I will announce the winner of the ski giveaway when this vlog will be out. So make sure to check your YouTube notifications because the Real Madrid shirt winner still didn't reply. So check your notifications. And that was it for the vlog. Make sure to slap a like, um, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment and I will see you next week. Peace!